Hearts Bev Code with the Rubber Buggy. I am today showcasing a Heartfelt Creations card base and using Ciao Bella and it is the Snow and the City collection. As you can see in the finished card, the layers come in four and it has major scalloped edges to be working with and designing. Starting at the background, I have the beautiful print and I have wrapped twine around it and I've also cut a fabulous fun die in the background corner to accent it. This is the fold out of the first sections that I am sharing. Each one has some fabulous paper behind, grabbed some of the tags or circles or discs and all kinds of fun borders. Uh, lots of cardstock for accenting and the coloring is absolutely stunning. From the one side I used a specific background piece and for this section I used the one with the touch more red and went with the background cardstock in red. As you can see there's more tags, accents and super fun uh, words so that I could be trimming and accenting the pullouts and folds of this what we call a folded 3D card. This is the paper collection and I am sharing with you the prints and how beautiful and stunning they are. The accent sheets are absolutely amazing for cards, tags, and any kinds of fun accents. They also would be great for Christmas tags. This collection has so much variety coloring and is actually very rich and elegant, but also has soft and bold tones. It's an amazing mix and you are going to love it. As I said, I am sharing with you all the sheets that are available in this creative pad, the Snow and City Selection. It is only being used for this one specific card and there is absolutely all kinds left to make many more creations which I hope to share with you in the near future. The added accents um, are twine. I did some die cuts both from Heartfelt Creations and from Memory Box. I also added lots of layers in the cardstock. When creating, I use Beacon 3-in-1 glue and also the edges are inked with your Tim Holtz, the Vintage Photo ink. Thanks for joining me today. I have had great fun sharing the Snow and the City collection, specifically using the Creative Pad. Be sure to come back often as I share more with both this collection and the paper pad in the bigger sizes.